Hey YouTube, TechVec9 here again today. Once again, I'm going to be showing you another useful tip today. It's a pretty basic tip. Just want to show it to you, anyone maybe um, switching from an iPhone to an Android phone. This will work on any, any Android phone or tablet. Any device, excluding like maybe an Android MP3 player, maybe it's uh, Chinese or whatever, you know, those knockoff ones or the Google TV or anything like that. Those, well, they don't even have an option to put a ringtone on there. But yeah, I just want to show you to you because maybe you're coming from i um Apple's Apple's iPhone or iPod Touch, and you want to know how to how easy it is to put a ringtone on your Android device, which is really simple. It takes about maybe 30 seconds, even less, five. I'd make it five seconds. But yeah, um, and if you are thinking about getting the Samsung Galaxy S2, I would actually wait because there has been a there's been a, a event occurred today. Um, it's like the unpacking or something, um, and they say, um, they released the specs and all that for the Samsung Galaxy S3 International, and the uh, US version will be released this summer, so I'd really wait for that if you are planning on getting the a Samsung Galaxy S, or even a good phone, I'd really wait, highly recommend it. But anyway, let's, uh, let's get started. So all you want to do is plug in your phone, alright, it'll be here. Slide down to USB connected. Okay. Wait till it turns orange. Alright, turned orange. You can just set that aside. I'm actually just gonna be closing all these out. Just so it makes it easier for you guys. But anyway, um as you can see here, that I have a song right here. Um it is iTunes uh format or that's why it's uh showing up like that, but Let's play it. <laughs> Alright, uh, that's the song, and that's the song we're actually going to be transferring. So I just open up my computer, and then you'll be able to see that there are two storage devices. I would just recommend you uh, put it in your internal memory. Uh, I don't think it matters as long as there's a file, but I just highly recommend you put an internal memory. So all you're going to be finding now is ringtones right here. As you can see right here. And see. See it says ringtones, I got all that uh, music and all that. It's just going to go to ringtones. Let's open that file. It's empty right now. But let's drag and drop it. And like I said, it only takes like five minutes, and it's so much more easier than Apple's iTunes. And it doesn't even need a computer if you already had the file on your phone. You can just while you transfer. Alright, close it. Alright, so all we're gonna be doing, um, just wanna unplug it. Okay. And now, um, just gonna go into your settings. And you wanna go into sound. Right here, you want to choose. See, it says right here, best ringtone ever. That was the one I chose. Click OK, and there you go. That's how you do it. And uh, let me show you that actually. Um, it's actually my ringtone or whatever. Uh, ringtones. That's one of my files. Let's go sample it. See, as you can hear it. Uh, that's it guys very easy very simple um, this is only for uh, this video is only made for beginners or someone who became from like an iPhone to an Android which I would highly recommend and I'm proud of you for actually doing that you know I think in seconds Apple's going crazy and all that and I usually actually I, used, I actually used to be a person who was all like crazy about Apple products and I was like oh Apple's amazing the best but now I understand that they suck to be honest, right? Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, or subscribe. Appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Thank you, guys. Hopefully, I helped you. And I'll be making more videos, so watch out for that.